village is in the local government area. As the report will receive confirmed that the bandits have killed about 45 people, which they are all innocent people from that area. I feel saddened by the unfortunate and barbaric act of cowardice with a heavy heart. I convey my condolences on behalf of my family and the entire people of Zampara State about this massacre. The act of banditry has departed to the ugly dimension. It has fuel to the comment of my administration. The marauders kill without regard for any rule of sanity, women, the elderly, and the children are not spared. As a result, a large number of people have been displaced in nearly every town in the state. My dear people of Zampara State, we are witnessing to what we have accomplished from the beginning of our administration, particularly the peace and reconciliation effort that we initiated and achieved. As a result, we have been able to shift our violent narrative to ones of optimism and peaceful coexistence. Unfortunately, things suddenly took a dramatic turn and things are getting worse by the day. It is clear that some invincible hands are plotting evil against our people with the goal of making our state as terrifying as it is where in the air. Maintain the report, the interests of the people of the state, especially their safety, security and individual as well as collective progress and the development will be the guiding principle of my administration. Let me retreat my call during the special sermon and prayers yesterday that our people shall complement the effort of the security forces by defending their communities in the wake of any attacks. This strategy is part of the decision taken by the Northern State Governors to combat the menace of banditry and related crimes in our region. I wish to call on the people everywhere in the state to be vigilant and to cooperate with the security operatives for the success of this battle. As the fight against insecurity requires concerted effort in one way or the other. Everyone and everybody has a role to play in addressing our security challenges. While security operatives restructure to deal with the crisis decisively, I urge our people to continue to pray for their success my Almighty Allah bring us back to the glorious era of peace and progression has resolved to begin and we have already begun implementing the recommendations of the MD Abubakar led committee on finding solutions to banditry in the past. As a next step in addressing this vexing problem, we will not spare anyone indicted by the committee's report, no matter how highly